Hey guys, I just arrived over at 14 Clearview Court North. And we'll go in in just a minute just to give you a little idea of some of the houses right around you. Beautiful street. I actually grew up on the street next to this one. And uh, it's a great area. Beautiful homes all around you. You'll really like this area. Hey guys, here's the inside. You've got a little uh, office area they set up over here on the right. It's your main living room. Dining room. You've got these tri-fold sliders that open up to this pool area. Got a nice covered area here. They do have a grill outside here for grilling out. Little hot tub area. Pool. Do a little loop around. I don't know if you guys are into kayaking, but it looks like they got a couple kayaks. Very nice dock area. Beautiful homes all around. So you are right on the saltwater canal. Let's go ahead and take a look at the bedrooms. master is located off to the right here it has a split plan so the masters on one side of the home and the guest rooms are on the other Good size room. We have access actually to the pool from the room. You got a slider here. I'm gonna have to check on linens because I don't see linens on the bed. So we'll have to find out about those. Let's go to the other rooms. Here's your master bath, separate toilet closet, yeah. and you have the tub and shower with a dual vanity. You got a vanity on this side and another one on this side. There is some room for linens in here, which, like I said, they don't. I don't see any towels here, so I'm, I'm guessing they're not including towels or linens. We'll find out. Off the living room is your little breakfast nook. Kitchen. Here's your guest bathroom. The guest bathroom does have access to the pool through this door. So you can consider that like a pool bath here. Laundry room, 
full washer dryer. We got one guest room here. And second guest room here. It is tiled throughout except for these little carpets they've thrown down. Actually, a big carpet. Got some extra dresser drawers in the closet here in the guest room. Off of the laundry room here is the garage. Let's go take a quick peek. The garage here. Gonna come back through the kitchen. Off the kitchen, here's your dining area. And they put a door here off the kitchen. Let me back up so you can see it. So you can come through the laundry room or into the kitchen from the garage area. This is your garage area again. There is a pantry. Looks like they got a coffee maker, toaster. Let's see what kind of silverware? Got full silverware. Dishes. Looking for glasses. We should have glasses on this one. Yeah, there you go. Cups and glasses. So the kitchen's well equipped. Um, we'll have to check on the linens and, and towels. I'm not sure about those, but we'll find out. You do have a little fireplace that's here. It's a gas fireplace. I'll also find out about cable TV. I know there's TV here. I don't know if they're including cable or if that's something you'll just have to set up as a temporary tenant. And that's about it. It's a beautiful home, um, wonderful area. Let me know what you think. I'll give you a little video from the vehicle of the neighborhood. It's a great area. You're only about a about a mile and a half from the beach. You go right across our toll bridge. Um, these are all strips of canals along here. My dad actually built our house here in 1979, one street down from here. So there's all these fingers of canals here. We've got 52 miles of saltwater canals that run through Palm Coast here. see some of the canals as we go by. Less than a mile from the house is the marina. And this is our main canal to the intercoastal. right here and the toll bridge is about a quarter mile up the road right here